to see what's good. Resistant fans or weights? You decide, you choose what you think is better or either both. We don't know, but we're going to find out. It's your boy Little Rock and we're back with another video. Alright, today we're gonna figure out what's going on. Which is better? Resistant bands or the weights? And we're gonna find out. We're gonna do some workouts and we're gonna test something out. I just bought these resistant bands, so I'm gonna share with you guys. I just bought them. You know what I mean? I just went to Amazon, ordered them, and I got them today. All right, so we're gonna try it out and see how it works. It's my first time using them. All right, so we've got this resistor band right here. It's the green one. So we're gonna do biceps. They say we stand it no longer. Yeah, by adding extras, you definitely can feel the attention of the band. Hook these to the doors. We're gonna hook these to the doors and see if it actually works. And we're gonna do the dumbbells on top of that. This is what the piece looks like. It's a little ball right here. It's like a little ball. You put the, um, the resistant bands between, and that's the ball. So it puts the hook into the into the door and it puts the security so it don't come out you know so you about to give this a try all right so we got a hook to the door so we're gonna we're gonna see how it works we're gonna do the back back farther you can um feel the tension even more when you go back but you want to come close you're not gonna feel it so when you go back more you put in the tension to it we'll do a couple of those like i can feel it like from my back i can feel it like for this one but there's good ones and the knockoff ones you know what I'm saying but I ain't gonna hold y'all early I was lifting I was working out on it early just to test it to see how it is and I tried the yellow one by itself just to see how it is by itself look look at this look at this 
right? Now look at this. See the difference? And this this one is um with this uh, 15, and I knocked it off of the sock. Like it just, and I can't find a piece. I don't know where it's at. It just popped and it went somewhere. So I'm not even gonna look for that. But I don't, I don't know. I have to find a good resistant band. Anybody know that they have some good resistant bands? similar like these but stronger let me know drop it down on the comment so i can go ahead and purchase that one instead of this one i'm gonna give a feedback to the owner that i bought this from you know and i said i was gonna do a review on this look at do you see this i'm telling you i don't know my own strength i was really pulling at the door and look like it's really coming like it's coming off like you know what i'm saying it was going in in more and then it's gonna snap like you got you gotta do better yo you gotta do better i gotta find some better ones like this this is not it you know i guess if you add more to it i don't know i don't want to break it and i was afraid i was gonna break it so i just did one to see how it was it was gonna snap the red one i don't like Extend. See, I already feel it. I already feel it's gonna snap. It's gonna hit my back of my head. going through with the tension and going back in I can't really get it all the way in because I feel like I'm gonna snap it I don't want to break it like I did with the yellow one I don't want to break it so to me it feel like I need to either get a stronger one that's better or just stick to my dumbbells I guess when you have more resistance on it, the better it is. That's how I see it, but I tried it, and it's really tired. You get, you really feel the burn, and you just get tired. Like, if you have more resistance in it, more bands on it, the more resistance, yeah, you're good. But having one at a time, it's not gonna work, because I see other people using one band and extending it longer and going through all that and it still made it good, you know what I'm saying? But not this one. So, what else we wanna do? This is good. So right now we're gonna try to do the triceps. Try to do the triceps. Um, trying to figure out some other workouts to do with the shoulders. As well, I'm gonna do the shoulder, shoulder, chin up like this. All right, I'm gonna do the triceps like this. I wish I could show you. I'm just putting my feet all together and pull your pull your traps up like this. You can spread your feet apart more. more. You wanna go down, get some more. Tension, you can just to grip it, but don't spread it too far apart. Just to feel that right there. And just get enough tension. You want to grab that so you're comfortable. Spread your feet a little bit more.
cool for bands, yo. And that's the reason why I never used them. That's why the reason I never used them. I gotta just find the better ones, I guess. Y'all gotta drop it down in my comments. Let me know which one is better, yo. I need a better resistor band. This, this ain't it. This resistor band is not it. This man is not it. I tried it. I get, I'll let y'all know what the feedback was into it and everything else. And I'm going to use it, but to me, it seems like it's not not much I can do with this. I'm going to switch off to the dumbbells. So that's what I like doing. So we're going to start light. We can not have to lift heavy with our shoulders because today I'm doing my shoulders, so I'm just showing y'all like certain stuff. I wanted to show you the dumbbells that I have. It's called like bow flex and they're adjustables. You see that? Five, then 7.5, then 10. 12.5, 15, 17.5, 20, 25, 0.5, 25, 30, 45, 40, 45, 50, 52, and then add it on the other ones then. You'll see, you'll see a multiple difference of that, you know what I'm saying? But to me, I think this is the best, the dumbbells. In my opinion, I like the dumbbells. I'm old school. I love that. This is, I'll break them. I know how my strength is. I, I know how it is. I, I'll break them. So I don't have no, no opinion of resistance bands. I just did them. I said I was going to do it just to see how it was. I broke one. I got four left. So what happened if I broke the other ones? I'm not going to have no more left. So I got to find the better ones. And it was worth my money. I don't, I don't want to spend a lot of money on a resistance bed that I know I'm going to tear and break. So, like I said, y'all know anything, drop it down in the comment. I'll look it up and then I'll see if I buy that and see how it works. Or anybody from, that wants to um, sponsor me and do products on this stuff. And I'll just do them, you know, for the review. And we could talk about business and see where it goes from there, you know what I'm saying? And we could do that. But right now, we're going to the dumbbells. Alright? These dumbbells, I bought, I bought them at Sports, at sports Authorities. It was like four years ago. I got these like four years ago. And, um, and they were expensive. They were expensive. I bought them. It probably was like 600 500 something like that. That's how much I bought it for. So, all right. Now, we're going to do the shoulder. The thrust like that. That's why I love the dumbbells, because you got your grips right here. And you just can just do whatever you want. Like, it's not going to snap or break on you. trying to do it with the sister bands you see, see if this works so alright yeah it's a big difference you feel that but to me it didn't really do much yo to me I'm not used to the bands and 
to me. I'm sorry. People have been doing workouts with the bands, but I can't. I can't get with that. To me, it's trash, y'all. It's trash. To me, it's trash. All right, we gonna get the dumbbells going. Another workout. Shoulder press up. Grab one like this. Start off like this. I said you drop the size down. We're gonna drop it down. We're gonna go five. Just like we did with the resistant bands. We're gonna do the same thing. Just because it's light, don't think you're gonna you're not gonna feel it. You're gonna feel it. Because you're not you're not supposed to lift heavy doing your shoulder, the shoulder last like that. The, the shoulder. It's not it's not meant to be heavy because you're going like this and then you can't bring it back up and down. Like it's too fat. You gotta get the extension in there. Perfect form. Boom. 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 Like that. And I do both, so I don't have to worry about switching back and forth because I already did it. So I was like, boom, one forward, the side. Like this every time, and then switch. Because you're doing this and you're doing your front. You're doing this here. That's what you're doing. You're doing all this here. Then when you switch off, going like, like this to this, it's like doing this, going like this, is doing this. And then going like this, is doing this. Then you got the back, and that's going like this. That's the triceps going back like this. You take a dumbbell, just going back like this. And it, 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 it take all that back there. From here, just push it back like that. Just lean forward, just boom, with the dumbbells. Boom. Or with the... Uh, which is the band you, you're using. Boom, like this. Boom. Boom. And, like I said, you got the sides. You go like this. Boom. Boom. Then you got the front brace. Boom. 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 That's working each muscles. Because you're just doing the shoulder doesn't mean that you're doing one part. You're doing all parts. It's like connecting it. That's how the body is, that's how it's moving. So, we're doing that. I got, like I said, this is the bow flex. I'm gonna show y'all, this is the bow flex. And, I don't know if you can see. Uh, you see that? See those adjustables? Dumbbells right there? Those? are all the weights. There's one, two, three, four, five on each side. So all you gotta do is put it on there and you switch the you switch the weights on it. I'm gonna show you. Turn it to 25 on both sides. 
that side too. So, and you're gonna see the difference. You see that? You see that? These are heavy. So you gotta watch out with your feet, or your shoes, whatever you do in your workout on. So right now, here's 25. So we're gonna hit the, the traps with these. There you go, guys. There you go. start this video so those are my warm-ups that I'm doing every day and then um, I jump into which part of my body I'm doing so say like today I'm doing my shoulders so I'm doing each, each part of my shoulders that I showed on the video plus pull-ups I did plus the, the dips you know what I'm saying that, that that is good too and I got a special special workout for you guys and I hope you like it and it's a tip a secret too watch the whole video to the end and I'll show you the trick to get you the jump popping you know what I'm saying I'm gonna get that jump popping so we go ahead we're gonna get to that right now let's get to the traps so these are the traps we're gonna be doing so like I said I bought this sports authorities and to me it seemed like it's worth the money. Okay. So now I'm gonna just lift these traps up. Sets you comfortable with doing 10, 15, 20, 25, it don't matter as long as you get like three sets or four sets in, that's all that matters. So, knock that out the way. Um, so yeah, we did, we covered the resistant bands and we covered the dumbbells. And to me, in my opinion, I think the dumbbells work better than the resistant band. Because you got adjustable, you ain't got to worry about snapping something or breaking something. You know what I'm saying? That's how I feel about that. So, um, other other stuff that I use, I'm gonna drop it down on the comment as well. Like, like the bow flex, adjustable dumbbells. Like I said, those are the best right there. The resistant bands, they are okay, but not my cup of tea. So, we got another one. This is, I don't know if most people probably has this or not, but it's from China a long time ago. I bought this a long time ago. So these parts work on your chest. The blue work on your chest. The red is the shoulders. That's why you see it on here because I was working on my shoulders today. So see that? You just said it. Shoulders. See it? The red. So it's from here to there. You work on your shoulders. Then the triceps are green. You work on the triceps. The yellow is the dog. Those holes. I don't know if you see it. Those that's the uh, that's the back. That's the back of this. That's what the back you're working with. It's like doing dips. It, it, it works. So and you got a lot of strength by doing that too. Doing this, you got a lot of strength. So I like doing this. You can get any ones you want. They don't have to be the same ones. Like as long as you got this, you good to go. You know. And um, my favorite.
bar as well. So I got a lot of stuff. So this one is called Iron Gym Pro Fit. That's what it is. Iron Gym, Iron Gym Pro Fit. So that's the Iron Gym equipment. So you know that that's a tough. It's real. So I got this. And I ordered that like five years ago. Just like it's like the Bone Flex like three, four years ago with that. So I had stuff already, you know what I'm saying, before the gym. So I still go to the gym here and there, but right now what's going on with the quarantine. So we're not allowed to go to the gym or something like that. So people are working out at home and stuff. So there's ways that you can work out at home as well and benefit your fitness and all the stuff. You just gotta keep it going, you know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, I'm gonna show you this trick. I was talking about the watch. It's the end of this video. Like I said, I gotta show you a special trick to do on your shoulders. So, I'm gonna be talking. I'm gonna show you it right now. Hope you guys can see me. Alright, so this one I'm gonna do with my shoulders. I'm gonna show you the, the easy tip how to do the shoulders when you're working out, all right? So, to me, I think this works. So, I'm gonna show you this trick, and that's the tip. You go ahead and do it, and then let me know if that jump works for you guys. But I think to me it does. I'm gonna show you. For the females, if you're first starting and you wanna get your shoulders up too, it's just like the pull-ups, you can do the same thing. We're gonna do that. Just to start off, just go down. Put your knee on, you can be on the floor as well. Like you, do, you go on the floor like this. And then go down. Like that as well. I mean that that help your shoulders. But you don't want to do that and you won't put too much pressure going down like that. Put your leg on a chair or whatever that you use, the couch or whatever, anything. So go like this. This is this what starts if you don't know what you're doing. You don't want to fall with your face. This is the start. Shoulder to shoulders. And all you have to do is put your head down back up because you're working all of this when you're feeling this it's already attacked it's already attacked so all you gotta do is go down back up and touch the ground back up back up back up back up that's that's all you that's all you have to do right there the chest Hit the ground, boom, back up. That's it. But now you want to do a bounce. The bounce for your shoulders will make that even pop up even more. I'm gonna show y'all. Now you put your feet on the couch. Go down. Boom. Boom. do whatever you can on that workout you do whatever you can on that workout okay whatever you're comfortable with put a number in your head whatever you're comfortable with you with then go with that you know what I'm saying it doesn't have to be what I did I go like 10 15 to 25 like it depends on you you don't have to go 10 times one time. You could do five, six at one time to keep it going, to practice, so you can build that up. So you could go next time. You feel like you can do more, then raise the number to go more. So start with five or six, get the hang of it, right? It's gonna 
to do all this for you and work all that out. And I've been trying that for like a month. So that works. So go ahead and do that. That's the tip for you guys. Helping y'all out with the workouts at home with the quarantine. I know there's a lot of stuff going on. So these are my tips that I'm using instead of going to the gym and practicing doing that. Plus my cardio, because I do running as well. Okay? I do running as well. Um, I run a 1.5 mile. Um, every single day that I can get a chance to do it, I do it. So, especially in the rain, sometimes I do that as well. So, if people don't know what a 1.5 mile is, that means you gotta run six laps. Knowing that they got laps, if you do six laps of that, that's a mile and a half. So if you do four laps, that's one mile. So do that, and it's crazy because I'm not a runner. So you know what I'm saying? So I was like, all right, I gotta try this. I gotta do this. So because the reason why I'm doing this is for my PT. I'm not gonna tell you what what it's for, but I have to train myself and study and do everything I have to do so I can beat that and read that requirements that they need. So this is all the fitness I'm doing now. I don't gotta put the weights on and do this. This is my this is my thing that I wanna do because I wanna get strong and, and, and big and and lean and all that cut up. You know what I'm saying? That's that's on me. But the extra other stuff I'm doing, that's on me. But whatever they want me to do, I just do that. And I'm doing that on top of my workout. So, I know I'm getting tired. It's hot. So, I hope you guys like this video. Again, go ahead, like, comment, subscribe. Get at your boy, Little Rock. And we're coming back with another video. If you guys like that review, I mean, I'm not really feeling the bands, but... The dumbbells, all the way. Y'all let me know what y'all think and drop it down in the comment. If y'all new to this channel, go ahead, like, comment, subscribe, follow it. You know, I got my social medias around. Y'all go ahead and follow that as well. And um, let me know what y'all think. All right? Because I'm going to start coming out with some more videos. Sorry guys, this is it's hot and it's workout on top of it, you know what I'm saying? So you really feel it. I'll just see the workout I just the little bit of workout I just did. Y'all really don't feel it. So y'all let me know your opinions, man. What y'all think? What y'all think is the is the dumbbells itself? Y'all feeling the dumbbells? Let me know if y'all feeling the dumbbells. Please tell me y'all feeling the dumbbells. Because I bought $500 of, of this, of this dumbbell. And you could do a lot with this dumbbell. A lot. You hear me? A lot. A lot. I like doing squats with these too. Y'all like it? Like, do whatever. dumbbells better than the resistant bands y'all 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 put it in y'all let me know team resistant bands or team dumbbells y'all let me know all right drop it down in the comments let your boy little rock knows which one is better oh i'm about to take a shower eat and I had a good time today showing y'all the view and we enjoyed the time and everything else we did. Like I went outside with my daughter. We enjoyed the weather, it was nice. So right now she's asleep. So it's the reason why she's not out here. But I'm running out of breath. Cause this workout is no joke. So 
I hope you guys like this video again. Like, comment, subscribe, get at your boy Little Rock. And we're back with another video coming soon. You hear me? Peace.